My first impression of Bert is she was just fresh off like the silver screen. I mean, she's glamorous. She's head to toe in designer gear. You will see her property is in one of the best neighborhoods in Chicago. It's very fashionable. She bought a, you know, a beautiful brick old two flat that she's deconverting into a multi-million dollar single family home. Berta was a classic situation. She was letting everybody else control how her money was spent. She was paying no attention to it. It was pouring out the door and out the window. She was not hands-on, she was paying no attention. It was her money. She was on the mortgage and her father was on the mortgage. So all these people were taking advantage of her. But at the end of the day, the buck stopped with her. She was part-timing it. I'm like, you have to take accountability. It's your money. Why are you always at the scene of the crime but you didn't commit it? Getting Berta back to earth was quite a exercise. But at the end of the day, it became about Berta. It was not about the project. She continued to make the same mistake. She continued to rely on people she couldn't and trust people, but not take accountability. And that was the come to Jesus conversation we had. I need to move and I need like Sean's guys. I think yeah. they'll move a little bit faster. We have a door there that came specially from Guatemala and ended up costing about $16,000. I mean, everybody should have one, I suspect. Fantastic. I know. And it was only 16,500. That's what it ended up with all the fees, but it's here and it's worth it. To give Berta credit, she was ultimately receptive to my advice and she did, she, she pulled her weight in the end. So Berta's property is finished out, it's beautiful, it just went on the market, it's beautifully staged, it's beautifully finished. We're optimistic we sell it in the spring. Hey CNBC fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Here you'll find videos from all your favorite CNBC shows. Be sure to subscribe by clicking right here. Click on the videos around me and watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.